it's fine. <laughs> Happy Saturday. Hope you guys are doing well on this Saturday afternoon. So as you can see, I am making my breakfast because I didn't feel like cooking. So I just made me a smoothie, as y'all saw, which is not half bad, but it's missing bananas. But I'm scared to get bananas right now because somebody is doing something to the bananas that's not good. And I ain't feeling no bananas right now. So I got my smoothie and I got some strawberries and some peaches here. As you can see. And this is going to be my breakfast. So I'm getting a late start today. Let me sit down. So I'm getting a very late start today. I do not want to get out of the bed. I don't know why. felt super sluggish today as you can see I don't have my glasses on so you can see just how big my eyes really are mm. I'm probably doing mmm this is sweet wow the strawberry is really sweet hold on I gotta eat this strawberry mm. so I got up and as soon as I started doing my hair I started feeling better Started getting a little bit more pep in my step, a little bit more energy. So I having a pretty decent hair day today. So it's it's doing you know what I wanted to do, for the most part. But yeah, so um yeah, so I'm gonna leave from here. I got some errands to run today, so I gotta go to Dollar Store. I gotta go to um, Old Navy. I need to go to, and I had a list of where I need to go. Dollar Store, Old Navy. Oh, Party City. I got to go to Party City because the 4th of July is coming up. And for those that don't know, the 4th of July is my mom's birthday. So shout out to my mom. Um, so she'll be uh, having her birthday. So we do two celebrations, my mom's birthday and, of course, the 4th of July birthday celebration. Or, of course, we celebrate the 4th, 4th of July. So um, I'll be looking for some decorations for her. And she doesn't want a cake. She wants a um, just she wants a coconut cake. My mom loves coconut cake. I asked her what type of cake she wants. She said she wants a coconut cake. So I'm gonna go to Publix. That's not a place I'd go. Publix or Kroger's to see um, what their coconut cake's looking like and the price. The strawberry. These strawberries are good. Now this peach. These peaches. These peaches are kind of touchy these peaches I don't know you get one it's really sweet and then another one be bitter so I got a feeling this one's gonna be bitter let's see no it's actually sweet a little crunchy but it's sweet actually this is good so this is all my breakfast like I don't know. I have not decided what I'm going to cook today. I got some chicken in the refrigerator, but I don't know what I'm going to do with it. Y'all got to put y'all down because this, this fruit is good. Like, y'all, when I tell you this peach was amazing, slaughter this thing. It was so sweet and so juicy. Now, crazy enough, what I did not tell you guys is I'm allergic to peaches. I'm allergic to peaches. I'm allergic to the... I'm going to have to brush my teeth here. I'm allergic to the fuzz that's on the peach. It makes my throat itch. So I go on. <coughs> if you ever tried to scratch your throat before, you know what that you know what that is. So I'm gonna finish the rest of the smoothie and head out the door. And I will see you 
in a moment. So I'm on my way to my first stop, which is the dollar store. And the reason why I'm going there is because I see where African Pride has come out with a new um, line in their products, which is the African Pride, um, I think it's Moisture Miracle, Miracle Moisture or something like that. Um, and it says it's now available in the dollar store. And that was like four days ago, like a couple days ago. But when I went into, I was in the dollar store, if I recall, a few days ago, but I didn't see any of the products there. So I'm going to go back uh, since it's since the dollar store is close to my house, to pretty much down the street from my house, and see if they have it. So uh, I've always been a fan of African Pride. They they do have some really great stuff. Um, I've never had any issue with, issues with African Pride. They usually have some really great products that work great for my hair. I haven't um, had any big problems with any products I've ever tried from them. And I know my mom, she's, you know, used African Pride. I mean, when we were growing up as a little kid, you know, I remember African Pride products. So it's kind of been a, like a, like a go-to, you know, in, in our household back in the day. So I'm going to check that out and see if they have it. I would really like to try. They've got uh, a mask, a, a detox, a self-heating mask. They've got shampoo, conditioner. Um, They've got an oil, they have some type of oil, but um, I think it's like five, five different types of oils in there. So I'm going to try that out. Hopefully they have it. Um, I'm not, I probably won't get every single thing in the line. Um, I would like to try the mask, the detox mask and the conditioner. Um, I guess I could get the shampoo, but they're supposed to be like $5 a piece, the item. So I'm going to check that out. And then the next stop, I got to go to, what do I got to go? I try to keep a note of everything that I need to do, like a to-do list, because I can never remember what I need to do. Uh, so after I leave here, I am going on to the city, because I need to go to uh, Old Navy and get some things. Um, they've got some shirts, t-shirts um, on sale, and sl the sling uh, t-shirts, which I like blouses so they had a special Friday but I think I missed it everything was like four dollars and a regular price of like $12.99 but that'll be my next stop and um and then see what type of deals they got going on <music> did not have African the new African pride products so I just got some um, patriotic stuff for my mom's decorations I got plates which I thought these plates were a dollar but I should have looked closely because they were 275 but anyway I got the plates and I got some small plates and I got some napkins and I got red, white, and, well, the white ones are in there somewhere. But I got red, white, and blue streamers for decoration. So, we're just going to keep it patriotic. Um, just kind of keep it simple. But, yeah, that's what I got. So, on to the next stop. It is hot. I mean, it is blazing hot out here. I mean, you can't, you cannot breathe. The humidity is, is just awful. But we're headed on. I'm gonna keep my air on, stay cool. Got my water in here, keep myself hydrated. So, Ooh. I will see y'all on the next. <laughs> I will see y'all on the next stop. Oh, there's a parking spot right here. How about that? Look at God. So I just pulled up at the um, mall here, this Bridge Street um, mall. It's like an outdoor mall. You can see some of the stores. There's Old Navy, there's P.F. Chang, Ulta. 
So I'm going to try to vlog in public because I know as a, as a content creator, YouTuber, um, when you pull your camera out and you start recording, people start looking at you crazy, like, who is she talking to? So that's kind of always been like a, a, a thing I kind of like, not feared, but um, just kind of getting nervous, like vlogging in public. So I'm going to give it a try. Um, I'm going to vlog in public. I probably won't pull my camera out in the store. Um... Just because, you know, some stores are kind of funny about, you know, cameras and stuff like that. So, but I'll, like, vlog myself, like, walk into the, at least walk into the door. And, and then I'll probably cut the camera off. But, um, yeah, so here goes vlogging in public, part one. <sighs> Alright, so I've got to get a few shirts that they have on sale. Um, I saw that they had um, two, I saw that they had some sling type shirts and they had, um, they had some sling type, they had sling shirts and they had some just the regular t-shirts. So, like across the street. <laughs> and, oh, maybe. Ooh, let's see. Ooh. So I just came out of Old Navy. I got a few things. I got some, I got a dress and I got a shirt. Which, the shirt, um, did I got this blocked off when you can't get through here? Is this all blocked off? So I'm leaving out of here, headed back home. It is hot, it is too hot to be out here and I don't want to pass out. So I am headed out of here to the next stop, which is, I think I gotta go to um, either Burgers or Publix. So yeah, it is just way too hot out here. So I will catch y'all guys on the next stop. Y'all, when I tell you, it is so hot out here. I was hoping and praying, praying and hoping that I did not pass out trying to get to my car. Like I was literally starting to see black. It was getting a little hazy there for a second. But I had to stop vlogging, uh, walking to my car because I was starting to feel a little, a little disoriented. Disoriented disoriented but just as I suspected so I go in Old Navy with my camera now I didn't even pull the camera out to vlog but just the fact that I had a camera in my hand like this one lady she just kept looking she just kept staring she just kept looking down I'm like I'm not filming you this thing is not on don't worry and uh, so I tried to vlog a little bit um, it felt a little it feels a little weird because I'm not used to vlogging in public and talking to a camera in, in public in a public setting but you can just see everybody just like staring and looking like and somebody come up behind me talking about some photo bomb but this is one of the reasons why i, I kind of shun from vlogging in public because everybody wants to stare and look like i guess you know this is not a uh oh just wasted all my water when you're vlogging people don't know what vlogging is here um not really 
I don't see how people are walking around in this heat. It is it is ridiculous. I'm on my way to pick up my friend. Hopefully, um, he's ready. And then I'm headed to Party City. But, um, yeah, I, I had to cut the vlog in short. Like, it, it was just like, oh my gosh. It was just way too hot. Be trying to hold a camera, walk, talk at the same time. I like... So, I will see y'all on the next stop because... Oh, I said I was going to get in and get out. But I want to kind of walk around a little bit more and do a little vlogging just to get comfortable with it. I'm still not <laughs> comfortable with it. But I'm going to put myself in those situations a little bit more often just to get more used to it, more comfortable. And then, you know, we'll maybe do some more vlogging out in the open uh, for, future, for future videos. But uh, today, not today. I'll see you on the next stop. So I'm waiting on my friend to come out. Just pulled up and just waiting. There's like a deep uh, hill to get into this apartment and I'm not about to go down that hill. Ain't no way. I don't waste water in the seat. It's about semi-dry. Oh Lord, look at the gnats. Mm -hmm. So we out here in these, uh, where are we at? Party City streets. <laughs> we out here trying to find something for my mom. I'm, dude, I'm recording myself. It's not recording you. So what are you doing? <laughs> Help me find something. But you can't see out of them. You can't see out of them. But I think I might get her a pair of those. My, I can't see out of them though. Hey, give me a look. Give me a hula hoop. You what? Give me a hula hoop. Get your hula hoop. Yeah. You recording now? Yeah. You trying to give me a hold of that? You realize I can't see you at all, right? I know, but I can. Nice and cool in here, so just gonna stay in here and eat. So I got the loaded pulled chicken potato, the slaw, and the beans. So just waiting for it to come out so I can grub because I am hungry. And so is my friend. <laughs> he don't want to be on camera. Looking really good. So I got my loaded, got my loaded potato, got my slaw. My bacon de beans. Is that cornbread? What's in that cup? Oh, no, pudding. Oh. another Dollar General and if this Dollar General don't have it then I know though, none of these dollar, dollar Generals around here have this this new line of the African pride uh, moisture moisture something other so um, yeah it is it is still blazing hot it's after five o'clock um, my gas light is blinking so I gotta go get some gas and check on this coconut cake but I have a feeling that a feeling that Kroger's is gonna be cheaper than Publix, but we'll see when I get there. So yeah, see you when I get there. So I just dropped my friend off at his house and trying to find my way back out of here. I'm going down these hills. And I don't know where in the world I'm going, but I'm gonna try to make my way out of here but anyway I've been eating some pop rocks I had some I have not had pop rocks in years so I was just at a store I got it all over my mouth so I was at a store and I said Lord I ain't seen pop rocks and I don't know how long but these pop rocks have bubble gum in them all right here 
and um but it's been years so i was having fun chomping on bowls and just reliving <laughs> my childhood for a moment went to publix and priced the cake for my mom coconut cake and publix is cheaper so i'll i'll be getting the cake at publix but anyway i had a really really great day i had fun with my friend we laughed as normal we always every time we together we always laughing uh and having a good time so we had fun we drove all over the place from we drove all over the place we were everywhere today so it was a fun day uh wasn't it wasn't planned uh just ultimately didn't have anything to do he didn't have nothing to do so i said well let's just do something so we just you know went some places and whatnot so but uh we just had a good time but other than that it is winding down I'm trying to get back home i'm not tired believe it or not i'm still full from the food i had it was really good i got leftovers in the back um other than that um just gonna relax for the rest of the day and um it's pretty much it i don't know if i want to end out the vlog right now or <laughs> wait until i get to this last dollar general and there's a dollar general right there but i am in the wrong lane of course and cannot get over and even if i did try to get over i have the hardest time trying to get out of there so I'm just gonna go to a different Dollar Journal, a different Dollar General, um, and then I'm going home. So I think I'll just end the vlog for now because um, I don't have anything else to do for the rest of the day. It's getting late, sun's going down, and I'm pretty much in. Um, I'll try to find a movie or something to watch. I may finish eating the rest of my food, which I probably won't since I'm still kind of full. But, um, but yeah, that's, that's pretty much my Saturday. So yeah, I'm just gonna go home and take it easy. And that's, I mean, absolutely nothing for the rest of the day. So I hope y'all enjoyed this vlog. If you did, I'm surprised. Give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to comment and subscribe and also to help me to grow my channel. It's just Janine signing out. See you on the next video.